Hey, are you tired of living at sea level? Don't you wish you could live in a house with a great view from the top? But hate that sinking feeling you get when fluid starts filling up your lungs? Look no further. Avian surgery is a revolutionary new procedure that converts your old human lungs into new state-of-the-art bird lungs. But why bird lungs? Let's first look at the root of the problem. Every year, thousands of high-altitude climbers struggle with this perplexing problem. The source of your discomfort is hypoxic pulmonary vasoconstriction, or HPV, which causes high-altitude pulmonary edema. Your old human lungs use outdated bidirectional airflow, where air moves in and out of the same compartment. Your lungs are made up of tiny air pockets called alveoli, which are surrounded by little blood-carrying tubes called capillaries. Every time you breathe, the oxygen in the air around you comes into your lungs, moves down into the alveoli, and crosses over into the blood carried by the capillaries in order to be transported to the rest of your body. Then, on exhale, the air moves back out. Because some air is always left in your lungs, every breath is only a mixture of new oxygen-rich air and old oxygen-poor air. This pesky pulmonary problem is triggered by the lack of oxygen in the air around you. When you're up in your mountain summer home, the air is less dense, and therefore, with each breath, you're receiving even less oxygen. Your old human lungs misinterpret this as the lung being damaged and tries to divert blood away. It does this by squeezing your capillaries tighter and tighter. This is called hypoxic pulmonary vasoconstriction, or HPV. This then causes the fluid inside those capillaries to ooze out like a sponge. And where does that fluid go? Well, the only place it can go, into your lungs. This is called high altitude pulmonary edema. <coughs> there must be a better way. Well, now there is. Introducing Dr. Siegel's new avian surgery. The secret is our new bird lung patented technology that our scientists spent years researching. Bird lungs do not use the outdated alveoli technology your old lungs use. They use an innovative new process called unidirectional airflow. Let's look closer. Instead of breathing in and out of the same chamber like human lungs do, which only provides a small amount of fresh air mixed with old air, bird lungs have air sacs, which function like storage bags and allow them to have 100% fresh air every time. On inhale, both the posterior and anterior air sacs expand. On exhale, they both contract. However, let's just look at one cycle of air through the lungs. On the first inhale, the posterior air sacs expand and pull air from the environment into the lungs. On exhale, the air sacs contract and push the air into the air capillaries, where the oxygen can move into the blood. On the second inhale, the anterior air sacs expand and pull in the air from the air capillaries. Then on the second exhale, the anterior air sacs contract and the air is pushed back out of the lungs. Why wait? If you order in the next five minutes, we will include the HPV-free bird lung update absolutely free. Normal bird lungs do not have the HPV reflex that human lungs do, so you'll never have to worry about edema at altitude again. Avian surgery can be available to you for five easy payments of $19.99, only $19.99. Call our toll-free number for more information and a free booklet on how you can turn your life around with avian surgery. Standard shipping rates apply. Cost of the product does not include installation costs. Dr. Siegel is not a real doctor. Side effects include shortness of breath, chest pain, and loss of life. Surgery has never been performed on a living human.